We offer rapid prototyping here at ARC as one of the things that we do because we needed to make model parts specifically. So to be able to change something on the model, and they're usually highly complex three-dimensional objects, we end up using rapid prototyping such as fused deposition modeling, uh, stereolithography, or SLS, and we have in-house rapid prototyping capability. Rapid prototyping techniques help reduce the time and the cost to make these extensively detailed models. And it is an essential in-house tool for us. Rapid prototyping can be very interesting because it actually builds from the ground up instead of taking a chunk of metal and cutting away. We can write a program and grow a plastic part, an exact replica of whatever part it may be for the, the model. At the end, we take the part out and we put it in an ultrasonic tank and we dissolve the structural material which allows us to make movable, movable parts inside of other parts, which is a unique feature of rapid prototyping. Uh, we also use it for embedded pressure taps within our radiators. So we'll build up a radiator in a one hit on a rapid prototyping machine and it will have it, the pressure tubes inside of it embedded where you wouldn't normally be able to plumb pressure tappings, which is pretty cool.